Hello Facebook, how are you? So I'm just back from Italy. Let's just check out that this is all coming through because I have a new phone coming <laughs> in the next couple of days because my phone won't do the app on Facebook. On my phone, it's crazy. So let's just see if anyone's going to jump on with us right now. And I just wanted to talk about the, uh, the water fast because it has been life-changing for me and it's it's taken um, a, a long time for me to get to this place but we have so much more information now like I'm of an era where you know we were told that low fat was <laughs> was good for losing weight um, we were told that you couldn't cure diseases uh, we were lied to forever and you know more and more information is coming out now and it wasn't until I tricked myself into doing a water fast without any planning whatsoever I all I knew was that keto was working for me not keto every day but generally cutting down carbs and making some some radical shifts in my diet and I not only started really healing from from my ulcerative colitis but my food addiction and my cravings went away um so now i don't crave sugar at all and my eating always was emotional and yet when you start to pay attention to your health your wellness your well-being how you feel how you feel calm, how you feel happy, how you wake up excited. All of those things I hadn't quite got. I knew that when I was eating really well, I felt happy and motivated and I could work my business better. And then when I was eating, emotional eating, somehow I was off balance. But what I hadn't really worked out was that, that, was that by shifting my eating was just completely shifting my whole life and so it has been a massive journey but the information is out there now and one of the most exciting things that I've recently learned is that the best way to really up your your health and your longevity and your anti-aging so longevity like when I talk about anti-aging what I'm really talking about is is staying fit and healthy and well and vibrant you know for as long as possible like i wouldn't want to go back to being 25 or 35 again but what i don't want to do is i don't want to get sick and old and overweight and inflamed and full of medication and all of those horrible things that happen to so many people as they age so the idea is to stay as we should be as humans so i actually seriously feel now that being naturally healthy is an act of rebellion and I think I put a post about that this morning it's like I spent three years being a freedom fighter and that's that's old hat now that's an old story now like we don't need to be out there pushing the agenda onto people who haven't woken up yet like I think a lot of people are realizing something is really off but I've done my bit on that now and I'm now wanting to support people who want to be on this journey as we move towards a whole new way of being, a whole new way of living. And if we can't become masters of our own self, our own health, our own lifestyle, our own body, like this amazing body that we carry with us through this whole lifetime, if we are not willing to master taking absolute 100 percent responsibility for self-care and for healing and for longevity and keeping our usefulness about us you know our, our sexual energy our vital life force energy then then what's the point i i ain't ever going to take medication for anything and i decided that about 15 years ago after being put on medication for life so um hi thanks for joining me anyone who's there 
So I'm, I've been offering, I, I did my first water fast with a group of women um, about two weeks ago. Uh, well, we finished like, even less than two weeks ago. And everybody on that lost weight. Everybody lost body fat. Everybody felt really supported. We did uh, some practices. We did some breath work, meditation. We did some yoga. We did some Pilates. I want to throw in, no, we did weight training as well, actually. We did a weight training. Um, everyone had a reason not to attend that one, funnily enough. I think it was a Saturday afternoon, so I recorded it. So I'm going to offer some recordings as well, so that all weekend you are offered support, and there's a messenger group, and you're probably thinking, well, I couldn't do that. And I certainly thought that when I was introduced to water fasting in Thailand uh, a number of years ago, like there was no way on earth. And people still say now, oh, I couldn't do that. But, you know, like we can all do anything. You can do anything if you put your mind to it. But the key thing is to prepare for it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little video for anyone who signs up so that you can begin to prepare for this at least a week before, if not longer. Like the next one is the 17th of November. It's not November just yet. So you've got a couple of weeks or even a week to prepare. And then you might just choose to do a 24 hour water fast. So you will, you know, you will lead up to it. You can do your 24 hour water fast with full support and then you can eat. But you'll probably find you want to go on a bit longer. And once you go over, I mean, once you go over, once you go 24 hours, you start to begin autophagy. You start to have your cells, literally all the cells in your body that are no longer serving you, all the dead rotten cells will just leave your body. Your brain function changes. You are immediately going into fat loss. You are immediately improving any inflammation in the body. You are going into anti-aging massive big time after 24 hours. The, the, the results are just phenomenal. And one of the things that I really learned about water fasting is the dopamine kick. Like you will feel inspired. You'll feel more connected to source. You'll feel happier, more relaxed. So you can start to make plans, business ideas, how you want your life to look, what you want to create, who you want to be. All of those things happen when you're in a fasted state. And then you get the, the serotonin kick in. So this is kind of a more long term feeling of, you know, feeling less depressed, feeling more optimistic about life. And, and so it's just it snowballs because when you're feeling good, you feel more confident. When you feel more confident, your energy shifts. When your energy shifts, you start to attract more. And so it goes on. And it's incredible to, to, to watch people, to watch myself even after. I mean, I know many people this year have had. I've said to a few new people that have come into my life in the last week or people I haven't spoken to for, for three years since the beginning, like my CBD oil business just collapsed because Holland suddenly decided they wouldn't send CBD oil to the UK for no reason. Like they just wouldn't. DHL, in fact, wouldn't send uh, the oil to the UK. So it's like I have all these customers for my earth medicine CBD oil brand. And I couldn't get my, my, my product in. And, and so I just was talking to the guy that designed my logo uh, today for the first time in three years. And I said, oh my God, you know, I have had a pretty shit year. And he said, you're not the only one. And he's about the third person I've spoken to this week. You know, a lot of us have had a really challenging year. But the good news is that next year is going to be the year where we can settle into being happier more fulfilled a lot of shift is coming where we are going to notice this expansive energy coming in of course at the same time we've got we've got the dark energy there as well but it's always that polarity and the bigger the polarity you know the more transformative energy is available to you it's like there's more millionaires made in times of recession than in normal times and so you have to choose now which camp are you going to be in? Are you going to be in the camp that remains feeling down, heavy, sick, unmotivated, lack of confidence, lack of social life, loss of friendships where you feel like you're missing out on something, fear of missing out? Or are you going to be in the other camp where you actually start to take care of yourself, where you're going to get the body that you've always wanted, where you're going to find that your dopamine levels are increasing and your serotonin is getting to a point where you're thinking, 
I really want to step up to a greater version of who I really am because I've tried the other way and it no longer serves me. And I know that the world is expanding. I know that as a human being, my light body is expanding and I have the opportunity to become more and more of who I really am. And I have an opportunity to take on self-mastery to a new level. And all these things I've seen other people achieve where I thought I can't do that, I'm not good enough. Actually, do you know what? Maybe that's not true. Maybe I've been feeding myself a narrative that no longer serves me. And maybe I've been believing in a narrative I've been telling myself that isn't actually true. Because I am the same as you. I am the same as the one that who is out there living the life that they dream of, living exactly as they want to be, with the body they want, with the confidence they want. Maybe I can be that one if I believe that, and if I step into that version of me. I did a, I did a little inspirational meditation with a 10 year old today and you know it was so interesting to see even at that age how we're already feeding ourselves with a lot of negativity and this is this is the pandemic i think of humanity is that we have put ourselves down and not believed that we are sovereign beings that and that we need controlling and manipulating unconsciously we have been programmed and controlled so being sovereign, being free, is about recognising that and stepping into that greater version and leaving the old paradigm to go where the hell it's going to go, which is not where those of us who choose the other option, it's not where we belong anymore. We don't need to keep repeating and regurgitating the same old, same old, because that really is an old story left for the last three years. And now is the time to step into that new paradigm, into that greater version, into that expansive, more magnetic, more beautiful, more sexy, more aligned, more confident, more empowered, more sovereign version of who you really are. So ladies, come and join my Beautiful You private Facebook group. Guys, I've got guys wanting to join me on this next water fast. I'm going to be supporting you from the 17th to the 19th of November in a Zoom group where we will have sessions and in a messenger group. And also for the guys, it's a women's group I've got, but the guys are also invited to do the fast because the fasting is what I'm here to talk about tonight. The fasting has been life changing and transformative for me. And I want to share that with you because I really think it's time for more people to realise that the number one way to change your life, to change your body, to change the way you feel is water fasting, intermittent fasting, weight training, Pilates yoga. All of that is the foundation to transformation. And I will put a little video below of one of my Pilates clients who I'm doing a, um, a podcast with in the next week or two. Um, and he's an amazing entrepreneur and he has had the most amazing results from the Pilates. But all of that is going to be included in the water fast. So if you're interested, if you're the early bird is before the 6th of November, £37. We will have a get together a week before for those of you who have signed up. We'll get you prepped up, we'll get you ready. Let's do this together. And um, if you know anyone who would be interested in this water fast, even if you you think, I'm not ready to do this, I can't do this, blah, 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 blah. I can also give you tips on how you can mentally and physically prepare yourself for this. But if you know anyone who you think might be interested, please share this video with them. Thank you very much for listening. And I will see you again really soon. Lots of love. Have a great night. Bye.